Hey guys, no gas Nico here. Quick little update on my battery failure issue. Um, it's still, it's basically a turd. Uh, can't go fast. I can't take it on the highway. It will fault out. I don't want to take it back to the dealership because they've already proved to me that they're only going to replace one module at a time that pulls a fault code. Um, I think, my opinion, all of these modules are bad, have bad cells in them. So what's gonna happen is every single one of the 23 modules are gonna pull a fault code one at a time and Nissan's gonna keep replacing these modules one at a time. What's that gonna do? If I keep putting new modules in this pack, it's gonna take my state of health and it's going to start bumping it up. Well, I wanna get down to eight bars so I can get a 40 kilowatt warranty replacement. Right now I'm at nine bars and I got a little excited just now. I'm leaving the grocery store and I was stuck at 67%, between 67 and 67.5%. It was fluctuating in there pretty much all winter. Well, it started on a downward trend and right now I'm at 66.38%. Here's a picture of lease buy right here. You can see I am on my way down to get below 66.25%. So am I going to take it to the dealership and have them replace another module, bump that state of health up? Not going to happen. Uh, I'm going to deal with this car until that fourth segment disappears. I'm down to eight bars and I'm going to get my warranty replacement. So for now, this is going to be my last video on this series where I have uh, this battery failure issue. And... Uh, and it lasts one for a while. Once I hit eight segments, I'll report on that. And then we'll probably maybe start a new series on the actual replacement of the battery and what it's like once I get a new one. Um, hopefully, as long as I hit it in time. I got 80,438 miles on this right now. Uh, it's a 2017. So I got till 2025 or 100,000 miles. So really, I got just under 20,000 miles to go. I think I'm going to hit it. I think I'm going to make it. So fingers crossed it happens within the next few months and uh then the exorbitant lead time they have anywhere from three to six or nine months lead time on these batteries so it might not be till the end of the year maybe even into 2024 before i see the actual battery installed so that's it leave me your comments let me know what you think uh, have you gone through this uh, have you recently had yours replaced how do you like it and how long did it take to get the battery in? How long were you on the waiting list for this repair to happen? Um, like to know, maybe every, I'll update all my uh, followers. Anybody that sees this video, check out the comments and see what people are saying. All right, that's, that's it. Uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, thank you and God bless.